Hello everybody, we are over here at 2067 Golden Gate. Uh, it is a beautiful condominium from Compass with Molly Poe and Deck. We're over at Central, which is over there, and well, Golden Gate, which is here. So, first thing you want to know is that there is parking for the unit. It's two cars in the back for the upper unit and one car tandem for you if you want to park that way. So you'd end up leaving your keys here. Or on the lower, or at the lower of two units, upstairs is a couple with a young daughter. And in here you're just gonna like, I think you'll love the volume and the space. It's really bright. I love these uh, fur floors that have been redone. So here we've got, let's see how tall the ceilings were. I think they were just about 10 foot nine. You've got the classic sort of Victorian double parlor. You've got a lot of details. We've seen this design a lot of times actually, but I like this variation of it. You've got the cornice moldings. You've got the leaded window with the window sash and the weights inside. You also got some really nice millwork and casing details here. A fireplace that has been updated. It looks like it's gas. Uh, I think it's gas. Yeah, I think it's gas, right? Pocket doors, typical that you'd expect. Again, this really nice work. The closet there, and there's a bathroom behind. We see this design modify where the bathroom goes in here, where this turns into a closet. Just lots of different things too, because we actually had a unit on Grove that looked pretty similar to this too. So in here is the main hallway. You've got this little alcove and nook here, which you also have this very large closet. So this could be another bathroom. In fact, we've seen it where this area was used as a bathroom. Then you've got this bedroom off of this double parlor or something. And ah, another living room here. And we skip the bathroom, we'll be back to it. But this is, I think, the piece de resistance. Look at that. Beautiful kitchen. I love the transitional style. The farmhouse sink, you've got the gas stove, microwave over hood, soap stone countertops. Really nice here. Oh, it's new, which is always fun. Open shelving here. And then this is the mudroom area. Well, it's now closed. Take a look at your view. We've got a shared yard downstairs, which is artificial turf and bamboo. It's actually really quite pretty. There has been some deck upgrading work done. Um, that is something that uh, will be in the disclosure report. Here's a little closet here. I think your laundry is downstairs, so let's take a look. Well, let me look, show you the bathroom first. Again, we've got this. Double parlor. I see that one of the kitchens here, and that's a dining. You know, that's lots of different things. Here's the bathroom. Nice and big. I love this little. Let's see, space up there. Sort of the uh, Art Deco inspired tub. We've got this extra room here. So let's go here. You've got a little vent back there. So maybe one day we would expand it because it's got the vent there. I love this window. You're on the ground floor and you're getting lots of light, which is always really good. Ceiling fan there would be kind of perfect. They have about 1,280 odd square feet, just about 1,200, 1,300 dollars. I'm sorry, 12, well, 12 to 1,300 square feet at thousand dollars at about 1.25, which is what the price at. Here's a look at that yard. It's really lovely, actually. The upstairs people get their deck and another similar mudroom set in. Uh, the foundation here is concrete uh, over brick, so it's been capped. Been pre it's pretty sound. Nice big open area as well. And your laundry unit is here. Nope. Yes. Maybe. I can't tell. <laughs> I will ask. And then you have a little room down here too. So that's the end of the old fireplace that I don't think is being used upstairs. And um, yeah, just a nice little room. My thought was if you could put in a door here, you could go out to there, which would be really nice too. Well, anyway, so offers are due. Yeah, that's interesting. They added this to replace it. Offers are due on Friday. Once again, um, your parking space will be there. This will be one, two for upstairs, and then your space is there. Your room is down here, and yeah, no, it's just a lovely, lovely space, I think. It's a uh, great location, as you know. The stick is really nice, too. The grass is just low maintenance, and it always is pretty. Really super easy. Take a look there. 
It's really cute. So, 2067 Golden Gate Avenue over here in San Francisco. This is with Molly and Declan. This is Kevin Ho, of course, signing off.